Okay, so the first thing we want to emphasize is consult your veterinarian. It is so crucially important to have an accurate diagnosis. So even though your veterinarian is renting a laser to you, or even though these lasers are available to people, we want to really emphasize the fact that the vet's diagnosis is critically important. So let's start today with the first step, and that first step is the unwind protocol. That's the go-to. That helps acclimate them, and it's, no, it's more than just polite. It's, it's really a good idea to use the unwind protocol because oftentimes a dog is coming in, or a cat, or any animal for that matter, a horse in a barn, they're stress involved. When they see something new, they're hearing this little beeping sound. Now, one of the great things about our laser, it doesn't beep while it's being used like other ones do, so it's less irritating to them. But again, put your hand over the front, hold that power button down, you hear that first quick double beep. You see all the lights are on. Push it one more time. It goes through its countdown, and then it's ready to go, defaulting to 50 hertz. But in this case, we want to do this unwind protocol and provide this guy some general pain relief. The wonderful thing, too, with acupuncture is that all those acupuncture points come right along the spinal cord, those inner and outer bladder meridian points. So when you're using a laser, and a scanning speed of about a centimeter per second, you're actually hitting a lot of acupuncture points without the bother of needles. And some cats, dogs, people, and horses are very sensitive to needles, don't really like them. Other uh, practitioners like to use needles in combination, maybe a GB20, and then use the laser on to stimulate these other points. But it's a really neat thing to come down starting at the base of the skull right down that spinal cord, depending on the size of the animal, maybe a half inch out. In the case of an 18-hand horse, it might be four and a half inches out, where you reach that softness where you can access those nerve roots. Obviously, you don't want to go right down the center of the spine because you're just hitting bone. So in this case, we want to make sure we're hitting those nerves at about a centimeter per second at 1,000 hertz. That's the unwind protocol. And it really does a great job of relaxing them. It's systemic you're getting an endorphin release. And this is why the animal gets really nice and compliant. It just feels good. You know, there's a term energy medicine, and it really applies here because after all, we're putting energy right into that animal with your laser and giving it that wonderful relaxation at the same time. So that's the unwind protocol. It's a great one to start with. Now we'll start breaking it down for you so that you know which setting to use first and then next and next. It's called our priority principle. We'll be right back with that.